Residents of Madison's Emerson East neighborhood say they're facing a problem no one wants to deal with rats. And as Ward Jollis explains tonight, their concerns are getting the attention of public health officials. While Denise Brayman's house might be the scariest looking one in her east side neighborhood, for her, what's most scary is actually what lies beneath. You're constantly trying to figure out where did they come in at, if you block that, are you, you know, are they going to find another spot to access? Brayman is referring to rats and lots of them. Um, I've seen rats running around, um, getting into like underneath our porch, chewing holes through like the windowsills. Um, to get access in. Brayman says the problem has gotten so bad that she set up these small rat traps around her house. So far, she's caught three rats in this trap alone. Obviously, this has been like scratched out. While it may sound like your worst nightmare, Brayman says it's getting to a point where it's commonplace in the neighborhood. Public health officials are even getting involved. Representatives from Public Health Madison and Dane County addressing worried neighbors Thursday night. Now that the rat population has exploded, they may need to do some things a little differently. You know, like maybe you can't compost as much as you would like to, or maybe you need to manage your chickens in a different way, or maybe you need to tend your gardens in a different way than you normally do. Um, that's where they go in and out of. As for Brayman, she's hoping health officials take yeah, a more involved so approach because she says she's tried everything to get rid of the rats. You know, it's kind of a little bit nerving. <laughs> and you, get, you, you can't get rid of them, and you know, you get rid of one or two, and then more come back. In Madison, more jealous, 27 News. Public health officials say if you're living in the area, you can take steps to prevent rats in the first place. And that includes cleaning up after your pets, keeping food locked away, and keeping firewood elevated.